Hey guys, it's Super Bowl Sunday, so whoever you're rooting for, I hope your team does good. I don't watch the Super Bowl, but um, if I was to pick a team, it would be the Patriots. So I don't even know who's, I don't think they're in the Super Bowl this year, but my uh, relatives are from Foxborough, um, and my dad used to watch the Patriots. I got a new thing today I'm going to show you guys. So I got this blanket ladder. I put some blankets on it for now. My living room, like I said, it's it's... It's pretty bare bones right now while we're waiting for the new couch. I posted a picture of it the other day. This is just all cluttery stuff. Some stuff's in totes. Look, they didn't paint behind, they didn't paint the wall behind the couch. I didn't even notice that when we moved in. But anyway, my cousin's husband makes these and they're pretty, as you can see, they're pretty rustic. He just used scrap wood. And this is like, you just gotta watch it, but it's, it's very, rustic an old farmhouse and i absolutely love it i got a family discount on it too so that's always good love it i just threw these blankets on it now just for effect to see how it looks but there's still spindles for one two three blankets if i wanted to my cast if, if i'm supposed to use it for drying my clothes <laughs> Uh, men you gotta love them but yeah there it is awesome I love it I've always wanted one but I didn't want to pay like 70 80 bucks for one so and I like that this one's very rustic hey guys it's Valentine's Day so happy Valentine's Day to anybody that celebrates it um we just have finished having supper not that long ago I love this, how it's not, it's 5.30, it's 25 to 6 and it's still, see that, the sky's still a little bit bright, so I absolutely love that, I'm happy about that, we had a big snowstorm, I should show you guys outside, we got a lot of snow, I had a hard time getting Odie, well between me and Mike, I was taking Odie out on my brakes and Mike was taking him out and we had a really hard time with him going to the washroom today, so... <laughs> Oh, here's Kaylee's uh, birthday gift. I got her one of those doll heads with all the accessories. So I'll give that to her on her birthday. Her birthday is the 23rd, but I don't know when they're having her party. Oh, did you go to pee? I might as well let Odie. I'll show you guys. Oh, I just locked it instead of unlocking it. That made a lot of sense, didn't it? You gotta go pee? Go pee. Look, that car is buried. Snow drifts everywhere. And she's pretty windy. Oh, are you going to go pee? Okay. So, yeah, it's crazy out there, guys. Oh, we have meatloaf, mashed potatoes, and peas for supper. I made the meatloaf last night, and we just had it ready for Mike to put it in the oven. So, it would be ready. So, that worked out well. And, yeah, that's, there's nothing exciting happening this week. So, I just thought I'd touch in with you guys. I'm trying to get enough content for tomorrow, Wednesday, but I don't know if I'm going to have one. But, uh, I'll try to think of something else I can do. I had an idea for a video, and I can't remember what it was. I don't know. I don't know. They're supposed to shut off our water tomorrow for the whole day. That's going to be fun. I got a shower today, and Mike's going to get a bath. And then we're just going to fill up the tub for, like, flushing the toilet and that kind of stuff, right? Washing our hands and stuff. It'll be cold, but it'll work. But I did have an idea for a video, and for the love of God, I can't think of what it was. But anyway, if I think of it... I'll try to figure something out for tomorrow. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you guys when something more exciting is happening. All right, Tigger's going to help me go over my empties. So the first thing that I have is the Sephora. There's not as many empties this time either. I'm just going to get rid of them. The Hemp Cleansing Wipes. I didn't like these. I didn't find they had a lot of moisture in them. The next product that I have is the Monday smooth lisser conditioner this was nice but i don't think i'd purchase it because i mostly buy drugstore stuff he's going to try to fit in that box <laughs> if he fits he sits 
Okay, the next is the Sephora. This came out of the Shopper's Drug Mart calendar. This came out of my Sephora calendar. The Advent ones from Christmas. Uh, cleanser, cleansing gel from Sephora brand. This was pretty good, but I like my Shopper's cleanser. I'm just going to stick with that. This is Olaplex number 9. This was like a serum. Any Olaplex products I would repurchase, but they're so expensive. I don't know. This is the It Cosmetics Blowout Mascara. This was pretty good. I didn't mind that. This is the Sephora. This one must be the eye gel. Um, no, it's the All Day Hydrator. It looks like this. It was okay, but nothing to write home about. I won't be repurchasing that. This, I would repurchase if it wasn't so expensive, but I have to go through other foundations. So I might consider it. It's the Giorgio Ma I can't pronounce this today. Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Perfect Glow Flawless Foundation. Yes, I loved this. I would repurchase that. It's just so damn expensive. And then last but not least, I will be repurchasing this when I go through my other cleansing bombs. But this is, you know, one is good too, the Shop Miss A, and it's pretty cheap. But this e.l.f. one is easy for me to get because I can get it at Shopper's Drug Mart. So, yeah. Um, it does, if you get it in your eyes, though, it does burn a little bit. I will say that, but not nothing too serious. I'm using the Clinique one now, so I do have ones that I got to go through before I buy more. But this would be so easy for me to buy because I can just get it at Shopper's Drug Mart. So I will be repurchasing that. And that is my empties for this month. I know it's not a lot, but, you know, it's it's something. I'm finishing stuff, so that's good. I went through my MAC lipsticks today, too, and I didn't realize how many that I have that were, like, really older. Um, they didn't smell bad or anything, and there was nothing, like, no spots on them or anything, but I know some of them I got in 2015, so <laughs> that's, like, eight years ago. So it's time to say goodbye to them. And if anybody doesn't know the Back to MAC recycling program where you get like a free lipstick it's only lasting until march 31st so if you have anything that needs to go back to mac i suggest you gather it up and take it in while you still can receive free lipsticks so i'm going to take that stuff in this weekend and i have enough for two so i think i'm going to get snob again because i haven't had that in a while and possibly velvet teddy i'm not sure but yeah i gotta take them back to mac Hey guys, I know this one is a short one, but I'm going to end it here, and I hope you guys had a great Valentine's Day, and I hope you guys have a great rest of the week, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Bye everyone!